Hey, Ernie, what's the word? So does he, Alan. My new line. Uh, great. Could I try one? Whoa, no, no, no. We'll enjoy them all together at the barbecue. What barbecue? Sunday night, right? Mr. Paparapakoski has a barbecue every Sunday night. <laughs> yeah, right. A new flavor takes years of research. Oh, sure. Yeah. To get it just right. Bob? Uh, buns. Buns. I forgot, I forgot my buns. All right, okay, just smell it. Mmm. Mmm! Smells great, Georgie boy. But I thought Mr. P was manning the grill. He had to leave. Uh, his sister had an emergency. Oh. What are you doing here? You know that disease that George claimed your uncle has? It doesn't exist. Oh. What's going on around here? I don't think you'll understand. Okay. George and his kids have been living with Alan and me all week. I don't understand. <sighs> Wait a second. If they've been living with you, where's George been sleeping? in my room. You know what, Vicky? I don't care if your uncle is sick. I'm going to tell him the truth. The two of you are not married. I know. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, 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 wait. Stop, stop, stop. Oh. No. Bob, honey. No. Hey, hey, give me some Bob, Bob. Ernie? Mr. Paparabakovsky. How's your sister? <sighs> Ernie... George and Vicky are okay, not... told me everything, I know. It's okay, I understand if you don't want to talk about it. Talk about what? Your sister. Why would I talk about my sister? Mr. P, denial is a terrible thing. <sighs> Mr. Barrett! Mr. Barrett! George Thomas and Vicky Walters hate each other. Ask them. George Thomas? It's my middle name. You don't really hate each other, do you? Absolutely not. Liar! Eve? Eve Scrimmer? Bob. It is I. George, who is this woman? Amanda, this is my wife, Vicky. Your wife? Yes, my wife, of three years. It is over, George. You are fired. You are history. Toast. You'll never publish another book, George. Never. Who is that? A former patient. I once operated on her head. And now she believes we are dating and that she's my boss. Well, I guess the operation wasn't a success. Ah, well, you should have seen her before. Let's eat. You uh, want to give us a soda there, Alan? What are you doing? Mmm, that's pretty good. Oh, yeah? What does it taste like? You're not with the FBI, are you? The FBI wouldn't have threatened us. I gave them a call. They don't even know who you are. 
We are FBI, see? Give us that cash! Let him move an inch! Marco? You're under arrest. Me? No, them. Impersonating federal agents. Chocolate! It's chocolate soda! All right! It's chocolate soda! <laughs> Yeah, I'm fine. Strong and Malone are with Earl Hyde Soda. They, they just wanted a can of Arnie's new soda. They're not the FBI? No, Marco's the FBI. Thanks for the tip, Mr. Barrett. Industrial espionage is everywhere. Thank you for your help. Marco, you coming with us? No. I quit. I'm gonna stay here. But I thought you loved being an FBI agent. Nah. What I really want to do Direct. So, what, they were from Rawhide? Oh, yeah. They've been following me around since the contest began. Finally, we got enough evidence on them to lock them up. <clears throat> that makes me happy. And you know what? Now it's my turn to make everyone else happy. Congratulations. You're my new spokes family. Ernie, can I speak to my family in private for a moment? <laughs> Nonsense, Georgie boy. Now, this is the time to celebrate. Well, Ernie, we, we can't... <laughs> We can't win your contest because we're, we're not a family. See, J.J. and Delia and George, they live next door to Alan and me. They're our neighbors. They're the Papa Rapakowskis? No. <laughs> we're the Thompsons. Yeah, you see, I entered us all in the contest because I knew that J.J. and Delia might have to move. So. And we wouldn't have gone through with it at all, except that we thought that the FBI needed us yeah. to. And... But now there's no more FBI, so we really can't lie to you anymore. You can't put us on your billboard. It'd be a public relations fiasco. Doctor, I'm confused. Well, I'm not a doctor, but I play one on TV. <laughs> Actually, I'm a writer. Well, let me get this straight. You fooled me for an entire week. You're, you're not even related, and now you're coming clean? Now when I've said you won? Well, we can't win. You see, it's not fair. I'm sure that there's a family out there that would be deserving to represent you, but it's not us. No, 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 no. It is you. You're my perfect family. I mean, you five would be the family I choose. You care about each other. You support each other. You respect each other. I, I, I mean, your kids are free to be themselves. No one pressures them to be something they're not. And look at you, in front of your house. You're the perfect family. But Ernie, it was all an act. Was it? Oh, definitely. I don't even like Vicky. I mean, well, I didn't. Yeah, I, and George was, well, <laughs> I don't have to tell you. Yes, you do, Mrs. W. Tell me. George was different. And you weren't? Absolutely not. Oh, please. If someone as wonderful as you were living next door to me, I think I would have noticed that. Why? I didn't. It, Alan, you know, I gotta tell you, if you had entered the contest with your mother, or, or J.J. and Delia, if you had entered with your father, I would have picked either one of you as the perfect family. Yeah, maybe, but, but maybe we couldn't do this without each other. Well, that's just great. Now I gotta go back through all the entries. I gotta sift through them and find a new perfect family, and I gotta go to all that work just because. Get a plate. Get a plate. All right. All right. This is the happiest day of my young life. You guys throw a great wedding. Although, uh, champagne would be a lot better than Barrett's soda. Not for a few years. <laughs> Mom? Listen to your father. <laughs> Georgie boy! Mrs. T! This is for you. Oh, you should be here. <laughs> oh! <laughs> uh, to replace Rusty. <laughs> oh, poor oh, Rusty. Rusty. Mr. Thomas, yeah. uh, Mr. Walters, uh, Mr. Friendly, whoever you are, could I have your autograph? 
Well, of course you can. <laughs> Picture time. Everybody in front of the balloon. Not that. Why not? Alan looks like he's trying to fly. Yeah, well, you look like a game show. Well, thank you very much. I don't think so. Oh. And that's the one. See, we are a family. <laughs> and don't we look good? Perfect, Dad. We look good. Absolutely. <laughs>